why did you uh, assault Rock from the Blue Face Girls Club? What the fuck was that? The video makes it seem like you just come out of nowhere. Bow! I'm and then a, she's she's saying like she's a famous model. <laughs> I gotta know what the fuck happened. I'm not. Um, um, she's not gonna sue. She's. Oh, I don't. I mean, she ain't gonna leave us brand deals coming. She's she's still on the concrete. <laughs> Blueface wouldn't let her do that. Maybe Tide Pods. <laughs> on the dead looks. Um, <laughs> what happened? <laughs> I feel like you and her would be friends. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best response to any question I've ever asked. I've never scoffed so hard. <laughs> <laughs> she scoffed. Wow, okay, that was a scoff. All right. <laughs> people, I don't know if never. anyone's ever said scoffed on here. <laughs> Can we check the records? Scoff is not really a common word on here. Never. Jesus, Lord. <laughs> oh, man. Um, all I got to say is uh, if we become a friend, um, I'm going to apply for a job. If that be the day. You're going to apply for a job? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Apply for like a, like a job. Where, like Jack in the Box? Yeah. <laughs> like, fuck it, I'm working here. I'm fucking up orders all 2021, 20, 22. Okay, let's pull it back a little bit. How do you know Blueface? Are you guys good friends? I don't know Blueface. Oh, so you just ended up at the house? Yeah, that's not Blueface's house. It wasn't in that video? Absolutely not. Oh, so she goes other places as well? I guess so. I didn't know that. I guess they can walk. <laughs> Allegedly. <laughs> they can walk sometimes. But, yeah, there wasn't anything in particular that really set you off there. It was just sort of spur of the moment, a little grievance. <laughs> nah, I don't just be spazzing. Like, I'm just a very respectful type of nigga. So, like, if mm. people were disrespect me, I just automatically just jump off. Like, but it wasn't nothing. No, it was no beef. I don't have no beef. Like, I'm not. I'm just not doing that no more. I'm older now. Like, okay. Nah, I'm not on that type of time. Like, I'm just, I'm not on no beef type of time. Respect. Uh, a lot of people want to know how what the state of your health is these days. Yeah, I mean, uh, would you ask someone in the hospital what the state of their health is if you didn't know? Mm, if I didn't know them? Yeah. Mm, probably not. Yeah. Pretty rude, huh? That was rude? Okay. No, I mean, I understand. That would be rude if you... No, I'm just saying. I mean, I I mean wanna, you said it. I didn't, I, I didn't want to get specific. <laughs> I just was wondering, like, you know, how you're feeling in, in general these days. I mean, how are you feeling? I feel fine. Oh, okay. It could be better. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> um, okay. Anything else we should talk about? What are you uh, excited about these days? I mean, I'm excited about when when Sophia like throws up in my butt again or something, or, like over my back, you know, like. Next Wait, thing. throw up on your butt? What, what the <laughs> fuck did you just say? <laughs> you know, like when you carry your baby over, Oh, okay. He just throws it. you like... Oh. And it hits your ass? You're like, oh. oh, my God. I felt it, like, drip down my, my back a bit. But <laughs> I don't think it's made it all the way to the butt. It got far. <laughs> wow. <I was> like, <laughs> You're really nah. painting a picture here. <laughs> nah, but I was like, nah. I'm just excited about, like, the future of being, like, you know, walking my son down the aisle or something like that. I don't know. I mean... Do we get to do that as moms? Fuck. What? Walk our son down the aisle. We gotta like walk wait. your son down the aisle. Does does a woman get to do that? <laughs> I think so, right? Maybe I mean, no. I'm the pappy. Right. <laughs> you you ask me my gender pronouns or but like you didn't ask me what I wanted to be called dad. I don't know that they would necessarily consider dad a pronoun. Exactly. You didn't ask me if I wanted to be called dad, but you asked me about pronouns. So one. If No Jumper wants to adopt or adapt to the new way that the world works, we should have a form when people come in here where they have to fill out their pronouns. We are dads. If we want to be respectful dads, yes. Dad crew. I don't feel like I've ever interviewed anybody where their pronouns were 
an Which issue. Then? Like, I've interviewed a bunch of trans people, I too, but it was obvious that their pronouns were the gender that they were I mean, I think repping. you just didn't know, because I've seen a couple of your interviews. Where I misgendered someone? No, you just didn't know. Yeah, because people be trying to trick you with the they, them thing. It's oh, like, yeah, I know the there's they, only nah, one of you. The they, I know them, there's only I'm one like, of you. <laughs> You go out to get me seeing double vision yeah. so for me to see. I'm sorry, that is the hardest thing in the world to get no. used to. I'll be like, what you mean they? Who, who else? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, like what? Looking behind niggas like, watch out. Bro, I've tried to explain that to some of my homies who don't know anything about non-binary. And yeah. let me tell you, it is not easy to explain the concept like, of that. People are like, hell sick. I'm like, like. Some people just be bored sometimes. Like, girl, I'm everybody. Call me everybody. Like, I'm like, what? People are just really scared of being boring, I think. That's true, too. But that's with everybody. Nowadays, it's like nobody wants to just be a plain ass old white lady. They're like, <laughs> no, there's, there's, there's two of me. I'm with them. Not Karen. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They're like, no, without this, you would be a Karen. Yeah. I'm Karen with a Y. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> Karen with a Y. That's dope. My son calls me his my first name. He calls you Karen? No, I'll just be saying, like, that's, not the, that's the old white woman. Like, You ever watch The Office? Nah. I was just talking with Currency about how there's, like, a, a beautiful woman on the show named Karen, and you're, like, you love her. And it's kind of weird that she's a Karen in retrospect. Wait, 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 wait. They would never name her Karen. What's your idea of beautiful? Because when I see in The Office, I never see. What's her name? Her. Regina? What's her Regina Jones, Quincy Jones' daughter. Hey, that's somebody's daughter. Yeah, but she's like 35 or something. <laughs> she's like <laughs> probably 45 now. <laughs> oh, man. Nah, there's nothing really like excited for me. The, the main thing that I got from this is that Idris is a baddie. Hmm? Idris. <laughs> I did not say. You didn't say it, I said it. I'm giving myself a quote of the interview. <laughs> I'm, I'm dead. I'm, 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 I'm deceased. What? Uh, what do you want to tell them to look out for? Um, shit. More rapping? I, no, I just got this new agency. Okay. R and M, and um, you know, I'm just trying to like get niggas that were put on the back burner like me at first. Well, I mean, I can't say that, but um, niggas that was just you know left off the board. I was left off the board, like, in the agency, you see all the Victoria's Secret models when you walk in. And then as soon as the niggas start hitting you, making bread, they just want to fuck with you. So it's like that one, I'm the only black girl with the tattoos all over you. Like, like, yeah, and I'm going to shave my head again and again and again. You know, For can, life? You can measure me. I don't care. You're never going to grow your hair out? Uh, I can't see that happening. Some Ain't people are married to her, you know? Amber Rose, I, I could never see her really having a full head of hair. Yeah, I, I, I fuck with her more with hair. I mean, without hair. But do you throw a wig on ever? I mean, it depends what country you're in. Really? <laughs> Where I'm at. You try to make yourself anonymous real quick? I try, but you, I mean, at the end of the day, you want a mask on, people know who you are. And I'm like, if I wear a wig, people are going to be like, nice wig, slick. My own mouth is the whole thing. So. But don't you, when you have a mask on, you feel like you just get like a, a thousand times less people noticing try, you? Yeah. Niggas trying to get little, like, niggas is trying to get little, like, you know. So the mask is kind of buzzing. I fuck with the mask, but Ugh. I can't, I can't breathe. Mm. I cannot breathe underneath these things. I was trying on clothes at the mall the other day with a mask on, and I'm like, this is not fair. This isn't right. I'm getting all fucking out of breath and shit. I can't breathe like this. It's like quintessential muzzle. Muzzle. <laughs> muzzle. <laughs> quintessential muzzle. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody make me a shirt that says that. <laughs> we could start a band. <laughs> I don't know if I want to say quintessential that many times in my life. <laughs> That's just going to hurt. I don't know why the random words pop in my head. Mm. Scoff. <laughs> yes. Our vocabulary is broad. <laughs> broad and deep. Deeper than the ocean. I'm deep. I'm deep. That's the only thing I want anyone to get from this interview. We're deep. 
We're deep, and we like Idris. We like uh, the Meg. Mm. <laughs> um, okay. Yeah. I appreciate you coming on. Hey, you already know, bro. But I'm taking this water with me, though, all right? You can have some free water. That's I fine. Mean, we got chips and everything out there, too, if you want to get some <laughs> sodium in your system. I don't have enough pockets, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to take them. You can just eat them. <laughs> do we have pockets? We probably got gummies and shit, too. I mean, do, do we have pockets? That, that was real. We'll give you a bag, even. No, no, a whole no. bag of Whoa. chips and candy. Is this Costco? <laughs> yes. We have, oh, imagine we had a free sample booth in front. Hey, you got to put the nigga with the apron on. Man. I was about to walk off with the headphones. Slick Woods, No Jumper, coolest podcast in the world. Check us out on YouTube, SoundCloud, iTunes. Like, comment, subscribe. Nojumper.com if you want to support. Appreciate you.